Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Sorry. I had to box them. Um, hello. We're doing another unboxing. This is going to be a shorter one. Mystery box. Yeah, it's a mystery box unboxing. From GameStop again. This one is Funko. Funko. If you don't know who, what Funko is, it is the brand of pop figures, which you can see on my coffee shelf. It's the brand that do pop figures, basically. Yep. So we got this one, and it was 24. It was 24 euro. I don't know why it says 22.46. It was 24. I don't know. Anyway, we got this one. There's a few to choose from down there. Uh, so we got this one. Our friend Susan or Life of Baby Roo. The Life of Baby Roo got the Minecraft one. So that one should be going up soon. So hop on over there and have a look at her one. So I'm going to open this. So this one video won't be as long as our other unboxing because we're only doing the one. So we are. So we're just going to open this. Got just loads in it. Okay, so obviously it's Funko. You're going to get pop figures. Obviously. First Funko pop figure we have. Hey, Harry Potter. Cho Chang. So this is the one from the ball. That's her dress that she wore to the ball. In the Harry Potter coming Goblet of Fire. Hey, I remembered. So this is her from the Goblet of Fire. Can you see it? Very nice. Very pretty. The next one. Theon Greyjoy. Oh, Jesus. We got a Game of Thrones. I have no clue who he is. But it's a... It's a bearded guy. With um, a flaming bow. We'll check up his character and see if it's the, if it's a character that we like. If as it's a an actor person. that we know... Okay. I don't think there is because it's Jon Snow. So I don't think there's anyone that we know. But anyway. Okay. Got this one. Oh, this is a DC superhero one. So our choices are Batman, Harley Quinn, Joker, Poison Ivy, or Batgirl. What do you think, Graham? Which would you like? Batgirl. Yeah, I think I kind of want Batgirl. <gasps> Guess what? It's Batgirl. I think Graham saw. Yep. <laughs> you cheeky. Hang on, can I have a look? Oh, she's in purple. And she has a little phone. That's so cute. You can see like a little phone, a little batarang. And what's the other one? A grapple hook. I like the way you can like close it and you can see still, you can still see her little face. Isn't it cute? That's so cute. Oh, and it says open here. <laughs> I love it. Okay. Random. We got pens. So, yeah, okay, this is a little morshi. Oh, yay. A little morshi pen. We got a little, uh, I can't remember what he is, but he's from her, uh, say Harry Potter. Fantastic Beasts. He's one of like, the little beasts that he keeps in his suitcase. We have a uh, another little beast from Fantastic Beasts. And then we have a Cuphead! 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 That's my pen. I love it. Okay, oh, there's more. <gasps> Mystery boxes! What's one says? The Spider-Man one? Mm -hmm. mm. I wonder what we shall get. There's a good few to choose from. Oh, we can get Spider Gwen. It's very safe. What do we get? Hey, we got Spidey. Oh, it's a bubble head. Mm -hmm. That's that my one. Is that like a bubble head? <laughs> it's Spider-Man with the blue vest. That's my one. That's from Amazing Spider-Man, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's the blue vest. It's like a little bubble head. You know that one, my, that one, my one? Because you're Spider-Man? No. What? Next thing in the box is yours. Next thing in the box is mine? Mm -hmm. What's the next thing in the box? <gasps> Cuphead! <laughs> yeah, this one's mine. I haven't played the game, but I freaking love the game. It's so cute! I wouldn't be able. I don't manage gameplay very well. Um, get very angry. So I do. Oh, who do I want? Who do I want? Probably the blue cup. Mug. Yeah. Mugman. 
whatever. Oh, I got the demon. Yeah. The demon. Hey, let's go. He's so cool though. Like I don't know if I can balance him properly, but and he's so cool. I like it. And no, I like him. Does his head move? No. Okay. He not bobble head. He can't even twist his head. He's very stiff. Is that everything? That's everything. Okay. <laughs> Making sure that's everything. So quick go over. Okay. So quick go over. We got two mis little mystery boxes. One was Cuphead, so I got the little demon dude. What where do you see? One in every twelve boxes? That's they're all one in every oh no. So he's semi rare. So he is. There is ones that are more rare than him. So he's like He's not common, basically. So that's pretty cool. But he wasn't common. And then we got this little Spider Man dude who's same rar rarity. So he is. And his head moves. Boop, 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 boop. So he's pretty cool. Then, of course, ugh, all of our little pencils. So we have our little fantastic... Hang on. Eh, eh. Our little fantastic beast ones. The little monsters that do be in the suitcase? No. Briefcase. Do be in the briefcase. So they're pretty cool. I like them. I think they're from the new one as well. Then we have a little Morty. Little Morty. And little Cuphead. Cuphead. Which is cool. I like him. And then of course. We got Batgirl. As well. And we got two pop figures. I like the Harry Potter one. She probably end up in my wardrobe. But I like the Harry Potter one. Most because I don't have space on the shelf. And I don't. We don't know much about Game of Thrones. So. Don't really know what we're doing with this one just yet. Um, I'm sure we'll figure it out. What we're going to do. But money wise for all this. I will say. Say 24 euro. Because that's how much was on the receipt. That basically pays for these. Because these on sale are 2 for 22. Or so. Or 15 each. They're basically 15 quid each at retail price. So you're looking at 30 quid for them. This is normally about a tenner. Roughly isn't it? 13. About 10, 13 quid. Mm -hmm. Roughly. The pencils are normally three quid each, so there's four, so that's what three, six, nine, twelve roughly. Because they're normally three quid each. And then the little mystery boxes are about six, aren't they? Six, seven euro. Yeah. So you're looking at another like nearly fourteen quid just there. And we paid like twenty four. Like we got great value for money in that one. I will say and that is one that is like a really good one. What was the last one we got? Crash and, Crash and Frozen. Frozen. The Frozen <laughs> one I did like, but you didn't get as much value for money. Because it was very childish stuff. Like So as an adult, it was more stuff aimed at kids put into it. The Crash one was amazing though. That one with the cup. Oh, that was badass. This one is, I think, the best value for money. I would have to say, I think, out of the three boxes we've gotten, this is the best value for money. Because, like, literally... You spend 24 euro and that's basically the two pop figures on a pin. You know, so you're getting all the rest for free, like, basically. A full retail price, I would say, you basically get these two. So you're basically getting the two mystery things, the four pens, and another pop figure for free. Basically, a full price, like, you're paying full price for everything. That's 15, that's about 10. So you're looking at getting all that free. So the mystery boxes are really good. We are actually contemplating you getting some as Christmas presents because honestly, like, you love getting someone this, but you want to get them something other than just one little thing. So you'd love to get them, like, a pen to go with it or a little mystery box or something else to go with it, but then it starts racking up all the money. So I think these little mystery boxes are perfect presents for people because I'm telling you, this one was great value. And you know the pens to them are worth nothing. But they're, they're great. Like little handy little pens. Especially if you're someone like me and Graham who love novelty pens. Kind of thing. We have a whole yoke full <laughs> of pens over there that are going that are wasted. But we love little novelty pens. And if you're a collector of like stuff, they're they're brilliant. These little mystery boxes I would highly recommend. They're from GameStop. And I think they're starting to bring out more. They seem to be kind of stacking up more and more now because those ones there were actually on the shelf 
They were on an actual shelf. They weren't yeah. on the on the register. counter. Okay, okay. I think they're going to start getting more in. Although it, I'm only looking at our GameStop, which is in Bray. But if there's a GameStop near you that are selling mystery boxes, that might be based around something you have an interest in, whether that's Minecraft, Harry Potter, Funko, whatever. I would highly suggest getting one. Or if you know someone who has an interest in one of them and they have a birthday or some type of thing coming up, Christmas or whatever, I would suggest them as a great present. I know I'll probably pick up one or two as presents for Christmas this year. Probably me too because there's a Dragon Ball Z one. Oh, is there? Yeah. I, I can guarantee a couple of people will be getting mystery boxes off me and Graham for Christmas this year just because we feel they are actually really, really good, really badass and great value. Obviously, depending on which one you get, but they are great value. You do get more in it than what you spend on the box, which is perfect. But honestly, this one, I think, would have to be my favourite one um, value-wise. I think this one, value-wise, just topped, just topped it, I think. Because the Crash one was, like, number one, then it was Frozen. This one just beat both of them in value. So it did. This just gave you loads. So I'm pretty happy with this. Are you happy with this? I'm happy with it. Yeah? Yeah. I don't think, besides the Game of Thrones one, there's actually nothing we'd want to give away out of this one. No. So there's not. Which is pretty cool. That's a, a nice little box then. So, other than that, we have a few more videos uh, going up. So hopefully you've been liking all the videos. We do apologise for all the game videos, but we'll soon be getting them fixed. Um, we're not sure what's going on, but we'll try to keep videos going up as often as possible. We do have a load of Sims videos there as backup just in case, so see how that goes. But if you've enjoyed this video, here for previous ones. Previous unboxings. Yeah. Previous unboxings, I didn't know what they were called there for a second. Previous unboxings, and then click the bell, click like if you like this video. If you have any video games you want us to play on Twitch, pop on over to Twitch and let us know. Gamer Lovers 12, if you have any videos you want us to do, leave it in the comments below. And I'm going to try to start getting back to the comments a lot more often. So we'll see you then, guys. Bye.